signed by Mike Elliott, and it's his first party game. This is, a, this is just a lot of fun. It's exciting. So what we're doing here is there's a charade set mechanic where I am the presenter, and I am presenting six words in a minute and 30 seconds to uh, the crowd. Who the, the big thing is is that in most typical charade set games, people are shouting out the answers. There's chaos. There's the one person that just keeps on yelling the wrong answer, no matter what you say to him. And but we defeat them by having everyone speechless. So not only can I not speak, none of the crowd can speak. They are going to be secretly writing down the answers to the words that they have. Now all the words are one word. You're not going to be like running. It's going to be run. You're not going to have walking. It's going to be walk. So uh, keep it to one word guesses, and uh, they're typically four words. Like you're going to have the, a short and good like area. Body. So um, I'm going to get three words of varying difficulty, and one is easy. And I'm going to show the car. So there's easy as green, yellow is medium, and red are more difficult. More difficult for you? Yes. So I'm going to flip the sand timer and then I'm just going to start going. So. answers and then what we're going to do now is we're going to go through and I'm going to ask each player what they had and this is the scoring thing so you guys so what did you have for the first word? First, I have tiger. first one saber two tiger now that's not one word so <laughs> so that's not going to be right but you had walrus walrus okay the correct answer is count so I, I tried the, the numbers, I tried the vampire thing, but now the two people who had walrus both get one point because they have the same incorrect answer. Now we go to the second word. So you had it is tongue, so we have cow and tongue, so everyone with tongue gets two points. Mouth does not get any. Um, we go to the third word. Sumo is correct. It is sumo. Um, no one else had the same the same variation of the, the word, so only sumo. Okay, the fourth word. Tree. Flower. Tree. Tree is correct. So those are the the 
the first four. Now let's see what we got on the hard one. So, fifth word. A water hose. I know it. Weightlifter? Adoken. Okay, yeah, the people that I know can get one point. It's actually bulldozer. Yeah. So. <laughs> I, to be fair, I had it before he said so it. So I, I was trying to be a, a bulldozer. Okay. Yeah. Alright, I can see that. Yeah. Now. Well, my first thought was Kamehameha. So. <laughs> so now the sixth word. Work out. Accordion? Symbolman? Dance. It is accordion. So, nice. now what we do is we tally up the scores, but now who had the most number twos? I had two. I also had two. Okay, so two. So, as the presenter, I did pretty poorly. Um, I would gain four points for that, okay. because I get the number of twos, the, the highest number two. So if someone had a perfect score, I'd get 12 points as well. Gotcha. But I get four points for this, and then everyone would tally up their, their score, and that would go on the uh, the scorecard that's included. I don't have it out here because we're just doing one round of the game. In a three or four player game, uh, each player would be typically presenter twice. We then rotate who's being presenter, and but in a in a bigger game where we go five to eight players, uh, each person can be like presenter once and then then tally up and that's the end of the game. So uh, that's speechless. Uh, it's going to be hitting retail retail shelves in uh, the end of September, and we do have some pre-release copies here at Gen Con that we're. Uh, we're selling it's $29.99 MSRP. So um, thank you guys for all uh, coming and playing speechless and sitting on my purple thank couch. Thank you for